campus again. Actually, see you in the building, hollering, Mr. World Famous. Just been doing a college tour. Um, I know you've seen the footage from the Payne show Mr. World Famous was at. Getting ready to do some schools here in the States, as well as we're taking a tour to the UK this year. I kind of want to introduce the world to someone that's about to do some major moves, make some major moves with from over in London. You got Jaja Soze. What's up, man? You got my homeboy, Lynx Connect. Tell you more about him in a minute. But the whole situation was we put together a tour to go over to the UK. We've had the auditions for the past couple of months. A lot of naysayers are saying we're not going to do it. So that's why I wanted to do this video just for you guys. Um, I think it's the perfect opportunity at one of the artists that Lynx and myself are working with. Her name is Crystal Gare. We have a photo shoot. As you can hear her music playing in the background. Um, we got all of her people here, her family, mother, father. It's just a real good positive. The energy is positive today, so we're trying to make sure everybody stays on a positive, a positive mind frame. Um, I'm going to let Mr. Sosa tell, tell you a little bit about what he's got going on in the UK. And then we're going to get to Mr. Link's Connect and tell you what he got popping. Uh, where do you go? What time I get to <laughs> Like, go, go to go to Link's. That's what he says. You can have a Oh. Uh, hey, dude, it's Link's Connect, uh, Connect Music. You know, already worked with Jaja ja Project. Um, Connect Music had a situation with a uh, major producer, Anthony Dent. Um, pretty much getting ready to uh, take his project, do it, and push it overseas in the UK. So that's that's really major. I'm real, real excited and pumped about that, as well as uh, Crystal Gears project. So, you know, working along with Fame, Rodney. Rodney. <clears throat> from Bachelor's Marketing, who's uh, actually looking at the wrong thing right now. But, um, yeah. I what else? I mean, I, well, I mean, how did you get started? How did you get into the coming to the music industry? How did I get started in the music industry? My first situation was uh, up front at Convict Music. Um, signed a deal with Mr. Devon Stevens. And from there, it just kind of rolled over into a lot of other situations. I did a situation with Jagged Edge. I was signed to Sony 07 for an artist named Yellow Wolf. And um, 08 and 09, we worked on 3D's project. 3D just got a deal with uh, Atlantic. Um, just, you know, it's just, it's just working. It's working and working. So. Pretty much, I've been working with a lot of people from Akon to Jagged to, to Carry. So, you know, and now Jaja. You know, we're taking it overseas now from the US to, to, to the UK. So. so, what kind of sound are you trying to you think uh, y'all gonna do with uh, Jaja? What kind of sound you're gonna bring from the UK to the UK? We're, we're gonna do uh, an urban sound over the UK, but we're gonna make sure that it still has that Euro pop vibe in the music so that it translates over the radio really well. That's really important. So, yeah. And how will people see some of the stuff you've done, your music, Twitter? How can oh, they? Yeah, you, you, can, you can hit me on uh, the MySpace, uh, myspace.com slash uh, L I N X K A N E K, Links Connect. And uh, or you can Google me at uh, L I N X K A N E K, uh, either or. Um, also have a Twitter page, it's the same, it's the same link, Twitter.com slash Links Connect, uh, Facebook.com slash Links Connect. Um, it's all the same. So. So would you have any advice or suggestions for any up and coming artists trying to get into the industry from your experience? Yeah, um, I would. Uh, if you're up and coming artists trying to get in the music industry, my major thing would be to uh, network. Um, so just, just keep networking, keep doing your thing, keep networking and, and um, you know, you'll get it like that, I'm sure. And where do you see the, the music t uh, going now? What do you think about hip hop, et cetera, R&B? Where do you think the music is going now? Any predictions? Um, music. You know, since a lot of a &R departments got rid of their um, their urban departments, they got rid of their, you know, all these different departments that they had, music's kind of really clashing together, so there, there's not really uh, genres so much as there were back in the day. There used to be like 20 different genres. Um, nowadays, pop music is just popular music, that's it. You know, you know an R&B song could actually become pop music nowadays, so um, it's really just do good music and, and you'll get on, trust me. And, and, and stay away from all the dated music. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's what's up. All right. First off, be on the lookout for that single featuring the group Links and myself about the work we, we haven't given them a name per se yet. They had a name. They were called Fantasy, but we're gonna switch all that up. Featuring this man. Releasing that on the underground. That's what I'm saying. Definitely be on the lookout for that. And everybody in the UK, Fame experience, we coming. No? Super Down. Super Down is the name of the record. Shows that I'm hardly ever in the studio. 
Super Down is the record. Jaja ja Sose. Lace Connect Music. Gashi CEO. Chris McGarry. We're still working on it, baby. We're putting together the pictures today. The music is coming together. Everything is looking sweet. Watch out, industry, a whole new way of marketing and promotion of artists without major label support in the beginning. But we're coming for those checks too. Stay tuned.